I am seeing someone. This for DJ. This is so sick. We've moved to Antwerp. Yes. We drove this car across the border all the way to London and back to Antwerp yesterday. All right, we're up really, really early right now because we need to return this car back to the airport. We've moved to Antwerp. We'll get more into that later on. But this is my new apartment. I'm also kind of cheating breakfast. This is cereal chocolate. Slaps different. So we are going to Brussels right now. It's our second day living in Antwerp. For obvious reasons, the, when I say we and our, I am seeing someone but I've chosen to just keep it private and personal. Private life, private, keep something in my life private. So now we're on a train, we just return the car. <laughs> I don't know why I'm smiling. I'm really hungry though. My hair looks crazy. I got my favorite shoes on. I haven't worn these in like three years, two years. God damn, the Rogio's are out. Love these shoes so much. This is so sick. Is this working? Check, yeah. It's working. This is so cool. I'm obsessed with this. The wireless mic is fun. Okay, so today we're gonna go hit up a few furniture spots to furnish my apartment. And I know some gems, some like little gems hidden in Brussels. I actually got my first ever to-go sofa in Brussels. Unfortunately, I had to sell it. So we're gonna try and find another to-go sofa, hopefully. If not, maybe something on that low kind of wabi-sabi vibe, you know, that very warm, bringing everyone together kind of vibe. In fact, I'll show you my Pinterest. I made a Pinterest. Here's a selection of images. So you get an idea of what kind of vibe we're gonna looking for in terms of sofas. It's so sunny today as well. So we're in one of the, one of my favorite spots in Brussels when it comes to furniture hunting. Don't know the name of the place, so I'll leave the address in the description if you want to come visit this place. Highly recommend it. Anyone that's moving to a new place and wants to start buying furniture that holds value and appreciates over time. Yeah, right behind me, there's a Mario Bellini marble table. Very nice, all black marble. What? I hope I'm right. I hope this is the Mario Bellini one. Don't wanna guess wrong, but I believe it is. So nice, it is Mario Bellini. This would be so cool to divide the bed from like the changing room upstairs. I love it. This for DJing. This is sick. Like my deck's on here. I don't know where we would put it. They got the metal staircase. I really want these. So cool. Look at these hidden gems. Brutal, hardcore, very bonnoui. I like it. I think this is the Bellini sofa, don't get me wrong. Very comfortable, how much? 4,000. You need to try this out. It's so comfortable. I'm not gonna lie. 4K, can't go wrong. No, 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 please, please try this. Try this. It's crazy. Oh, yeah, that's really cool. Yeah. They've got the racket chairs. They've got the chairs just chilling. These are like the supreme or like the palace of streetwear in terms of furniture because everyone has the fake versions of these because every single like furniture department store retailer is selling fake versions of these. Like H&M has their version. Zara has their version. It's very, very iconic. I like this chair. Like a big massive table. I'll sit in this chair and do my work. I like to spin. That's your vibe. She said it looks like Ikea furniture. You're a violation. <laughs> I do like these chairs, man. I like how it's like aged. These are 350. That's a nice price. Uh, this sofa arrangement's nice. It looks like that one that, um, I forget the name of it, but Drake has one as well. It's very nice. 
I'm going to start rating these places. And I don't know the name of this place. It's literally nowhere. Um, but I'm going to rate this place a solid four out of five. It's pretty easy to navigate. The prices are there. So you can kind of go over what the prices are straight away without talking to anyone. And they have a really good selection and a very big variety of furniture pieces that kind of caters for like everyone's style and choices, you know? So yeah, rate this place, four out of five. There's a place opposite this road where I got my sofa from. That's probably gonna be a five out of five. Okay, so we just left and we purchased a couple things in the bag. We got this nice light and we got the vase. Colors look really nice with each other and I tried to get a better price on the Bellini sofa and she said she can only do 4,500 if we pay cash. She only took 300 euros off. I'm gonna continue the hunt for a new sofa. Also the place I wanna visit is across the street and they're not open yet. And that's the secret place with the good prices. That place there, five out of five, hands down. And for future reference, bring an Ikea bag. If you're gonna buy small things, I mean, check this out. The sofa looks pretty nice, the table looks pretty good. This is one of my favorite pieces right here. Always wanted this, kind of pricey. The corner unit of a to-go. Oh, reminds me of my to-go. There's the chairs, I'm gonna have to buy them. God, I love this place. Okay, so we just left my favorite shop in Brussels, and we purchased two tulip chairs that you're gonna see us pick up. Um, it makes sense to be driving here and picking it up and delivering it to my own house because it was like another 100 euros for a van. Uh, the sofa was very, very nice. Um, the issue was, it was not really an issue, but it was a replica. It came out in the 70s and the original came out in the 60s. So that's why it was 1,800 euros. Those chairs go for 7,000 euros and the one in there, 4,800 euros. Wait, that one over there is 4,800. But... And it's really good condition and the market price is six, 7,000. Hmm. We're gonna go and contemplate about the sofa that we found for 4K, because if we can flip it for 7K, 8K, we might as well purchase it, flip it straight away, get our money back, and then buy the other one. Because um, there was actually two in that place for 4.8K. We'll see what happens. The hustle, the life. Yeah, so hustle. every day, 10 until 6. Yes. All right, we bought the chairs, the plastic ones, two of them. That's it, we've got four chairs now. We still need to get a table, we still need to get a sofa, but we're gonna head back. This place I'm obsessed with, like, I can't lie, I kinda got lost in here. It's Ikea, but designer furniture. Everything's for sale, very interesting. Everything is sold by individuals that wanna consign there. Like Supreme Clothes, I think it's shit. Tulip chairs. And yeah, they're sold. 10K for the set. Kind of pricey. Kind of pricey? Very pricey. This place is crazy. What's down here? Found these cool chairs here. Had to buy them. This is very cool. Just needs to be cleaned a bit. You know me. I love the space age vibes. Can't complain. Can't go wrong. I didn't even tell you guys, um, I arrived in Brussels, like basically 10 minutes after I dropped off the car and the guy said that uh, in the email, I've damaged the car and there's a little scratch outside. I don't know how he got a scratch on the car. My driving skills are impeccable. I can't even, I No, 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 I told you my bum was getting wet. My whole backside was getting, and I was like, it's weird, it didn't feel nice. The, the water spilled in my bag, the water bottle. 